My wife and I each bought one of these bikes, mine in black and hers in white. The bikes were well packed in their boxes to prevent damage. Upon unpacking them, we were both impressed by the paint and finish. These are really good looking bikes. Some assembly is required, but it's relatively easy and the necessary tools are included. The individual parts include the frame with the rear wheel attached, the front wheel, handlebars, seat assembly, fenders, reflector, and battery. The written instructions provided weren't particularly clear or helpful, but there's an excellent step-by-step -step assembly video on the Amazon product page. We simply followed along, pausing the video after each step. Once assembled, the bikes are quite heavy, perhaps a bit heavier than I would have liked, but they are definitely sturdy. There's no guide for tire inflation pressure, so I checked online and found that 35 PSI is ideal for this type of tire and works well. The folding feature is effective once you figure it out. It was a bit tricky at first, but once you know the technique, it's not a problem. Riding these bikes is great fun. In manual mode, the 21 speeds offer a nice wide range of effort and speed. The shift mechanisms work smoothly, and the brakes are strong. It's when you engage the battery power that the fun really starts. In power assist mode, the motor works while you pedal to provide an unbelievable boost. Even on the lowest power setting, the boost was significant and the bike just takes off. In power-only mode, you don't pedal at all and the battery does all the work. Acceleration is controlled by a circular throttle by the right handle grip. The power level is decent and the bike can reach good speeds on battery alone. I'm not sure how far or long you could ride on power alone since I haven't used power only for extended rides. Overall, I think this is a great electric bike for the money.